Hello, I'm Robbie Fowler and you're watching Redman TV. Mate, you come all the way from Egypt for the game? Yeah, all the way from Alexandria. Very nice. Yeah. Very nice. How, how does the balmy weather of Liverpool compare? I love it. I love it. <laughs> this is winter weather in Egypt. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sweating today. Um, I mean, ultimately, not a not a very exciting game, but but three points. Nerve wracking, but three points, clean sheet, awesome. Yeah, excellent. Yeah. Uh, who, was your, who was your man of the match if you had to pick one? Ben Teke. Ben Teke. Ben Teke. Ben Teke. Yeah. yeah. I mean, ultimately. I mean, as he does. As he always does. Yeah. Yeah. He could have scored at the start of the first half. Uh, sorry, the end of the first half. I mean, Ben Teke, that's what we've bought him for to score goals. Yes. Hold out the ball, yes. pass it on. He's done, he's done the job. He is also great in aerial duels. Yeah, he doesn't lose it. He looks machine. Awesome. Yeah. He seems to get better. Well, the more minutes yeah. he's got on the pitch, the better and better he's becoming. He surprised me with some of his touches yeah. and how, 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 uh, how, how much class he's got as a, as a player as well. Anyone else? Um, Nathaniel Klein, great game at right back. He's done really well as well. Um, Joe Gomez as well. Yeah. I think he was solid for 18 year old and his for debut. I think he played the ball well, yeah. kept him moving. Well. Absolutely outstanding. Anyone else? Lovren was awesome too. Lovren? I know, I'm not, I'm not used to saying it. <laughs> I know, I'm not used to too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah but he was he was okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Lovren! <laughs> he was okay! <laughs> eventually, eventually. You got there in the end. Yeah, okay, well, boys, listen, thanks very much for, for dropping by. Glad you've got, you. Glad you've got to see a win. Like, I mean, thanks for showing them tickets out. Yeah. Nice one, lads. Not sure whether my arse or my heart can take an entire season of performances like that, but ultimately, you know, if we get to the end of the season and we did that for, for the entire season and we won every, every game 1-0 horribly, and we won the title, who'd give a fuck? It's not going to happen. I want to see us perform better. I want to see us be more attacking. I want to see us do more. But, you know.